Welcome to another episode of OMB Warehouse and the Gray Goat Garage. Today what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to take the throttle linkage on one of the Predator engines and make it free like this. Here's a stock linkage setup and you'll notice how it'll stay in one position. This is done for the guys with a cement mixer or a generator and um, this allows them to keep a constant RPM. But uh, for a go-kart or minibike, that's not something we want. So we're gonna get this fixed. So let me show you how. The stock linkage here has a, a pivot point with a 10 millimeter nut. We're gonna go ahead and take that 10 millimeter nut off. Take this funny shaped cone washer off. And don't forget, it's got the little tab that indexes here on the idle screw. And we're just going to gently pull this up and just move it out of the way. And then we're going to lift this wavy spring washer out. You'll notice how that washer has a bend to it. And once this is tightened down, that's what holds the pressure with this whole assembly. You'll see the nylon washer down here that uh, helps keep it smooth. So let's take this washer out completely and reassemble the unit. So I'm going to set this back down on there. I'm going to put my funny shaped cone assembly back on while indexing to the upright here on the uh, idle adjustment screw. That's not the idle adjustment screw. That's the top end speed limiter screw. Sorry. So what I like to do is take and tighten this all the way down. You'll notice it's got a nice spring action to it. It snaps back readily and uh, there's not a lot of play in it. It's very smooth and that will allow you to hook up the, the OMB throttle linkage to this engine and have it be nice and smooth and snap back for you. Thanks for stopping by OMB Warehouse and the Gray Goat Garage. Visit us online at ombwarehouse.com or come hang out with the crazies over at oldminibikes.com. A lot of good information there. Um, this will uh, be a, a great upgrade for you. I've got too many people asking me, uh, hey, Eric, you know, why, why doesn't my throttle snap back? That is the number one cause. A lot of people just back that nut off, but you still got that spring washer in there. Wouldn't hurt to put a little dab of grease in there. Um, won't hurt a thing. Help keep everything smooth and uh, your throttle operating properly. Thanks for stopping by.